I'm Patrick with the Kentucky Gun Company. And I'm Tiffany. Concealed carry is at an all-time high. More people are carrying concealed than ever before. And if you're in the market for a concealed carry piece, a special revolver, you've probably came across the Smith & Wesson J-Frame, a very popular option. You've probably also came across the Smith & or the, I'm sorry, the Ruger LCR, also a very another popular option. And you've probably also came across some of the Taurus's smaller revolvers, in particular the Model 85 or maybe even the 94s. But now Taurus has a brand new option for you. This just hit the market. This is the brand new Taurus Model 85 View. Okay, let's go over some of the specs of the gun that makes this gun different than all the others. First and foremost, I'd say probably what most makes it the most notable is the nine ounce weight of the gun. I'm gonna place it on the scale here for you. Get you a look at that, 9.4. To get this weight, the gun has a titanium cylinder in barrel, and you'll see also too on here, the barrel is only one inches long, so makes it better for concealed carry. Overall length on the gun, five inches. You can see the polycarbonate side plate here that allows you to take a good look at the function of the gun. It's got about a nine pound trigger pull on it. Pretty typical for your double action revolvers. Other than the nine ounce weight, one of the most notable features of this gun is probably the polycarbonate plate we have right here. Of course, that's where it gets its name, the view. It's gonna be either A, a hit with people, or B, they're just not gonna like it. It's all about personal preference, but definitely, for sure, it is one unique feature to the gun. Um, again, it allows you to watch the function of the revolver. Really neat feature. One thing you do need to check out on this gun, and this is completely unique to this revolver, first and foremost, this, the small grip. The grip is extremely small. But also look at the curvature of the grip. And it also has contour grip panels. As you notice, this side is a little bit thicker, this side is a little bit thinner. And as you see here on Tiffany, this will allow you to, it allows the revolver to hug the body a little bit tighter. Let's do a little bit of comparisons just so you guys at home know exactly what we're talking about as far as the size. You know, we really emphasize the size on this gun. First, let's just weigh the Ruger LCR. This is a standard 38 special LCR, comes in at 13.45. Again, you no know, Ruger put the nice uh, polymer frame on here to cut down the weight, so that is a very light revolver. The Smith & Wesson J frame, again, a full, uh, has the aluminum frame, 14.65. These are in ounces, too. And here is the new view. They advertise at 9.5, so I mean, exactly our scale is reading 9.55, so the advertisement is definitely spot on. And look at the size. Let's do a size comparison. There's the view. There's the Smith & Wesson J-frame. Put it on top of one another. Hoping my fingers are not in the way. There's the Ruger LCR. And there's the new view. As you can see, it's a much, much smaller pistol. Much, much smaller revolver. And again, let's look at the grip. You can see the curvature. You could probably the curvature is probably a little bit more noticeable when you hold it right next to another gun, especially on the grip. Okay, we've showed you all the specs. I would love to go shoot this revolver, but unfortunately I have to get ready for the SHOT Show. The SHOT Show is the number one industry show uh, for our entire industry, for the firearms industry. And we will be there bringing you all the new products for 2014. And also, most importantly, we will be giving away a lot of products that we are uh, doing the, the videos on. We will be giving away one of these Taurus views, and you can only win this revolver if you're a subscriber. It's just random pick. We're going to give it to a random subscriber, but if you don't subscribe, you cannot win. So I'm going to send Tiffany to the range. She's going to shoot it, and we're going to shoot it with some very nice uh, Remington stuff today. We're going to shoot it with some plus P loads, so we're not going to skimp on it. It's not going to be light loads. It's not going to be range loads. If you're going to carry this gun, you're going to carry it with some plus P, some defensive loads, and that's exactly what we're going to shoot it with. All right, so we're out here at the range. We're gonna be putting our Taurus Model 85 View to the test. Again, we're not out here for accuracy today. We're out here just for the pure functionality of the gun. Of course, with the one inch barrel, you're not gonna be able to achieve that grade of accuracy. So we're gonna put it to the test today. We're gonna to be shooting the 38 Special Remington Plus P through it. We're gonna put about five rounds through it to see what we got here and go from there.
see what we get. Don't worry about the pictures. Now some people might have a few concerns about the short ejector rod you see here, but um, definitely, as you can tell, no problem whatsoever, function reliably. Um, again, this is a small concealed carry gun. It's definitely got a little bite to it, got a little kick to it, as you can tell from the, the web of my hand here. But again, you know, the small one inch barrel, the small grip on it. It doesn't have the, the typical rubberized grip that some of your larger framed revolvers would. Um, but again, too, hopefully, God willing, you're never put in a situation where you would have to use this, but I think recoil is going to be the last thing on your mind if you're ever put in a situation like that. So it's got my vote. Um, we're going to put a few more rounds through it and uh, go from there. Again, keep in mind, we're not shooting a light load through this gun. We're shooting the 38 Special Plus P, more powder. Um, we're at a distance of about five yards here. It's going to be your typical self-defense yardage. You're not going to use it for anything more than five yards. It's not designed for that. It's not a range gun. It's not something you're going to hobby shoot or anything of that nature. It is a concealed carry self-defense gun. So again, we're at a difference at a distance of about uh, five yards here and we're gonna see what we can get here. All right, so all in all, as far as concealed carry, it's an awesome gun. Um, I actually wish Taurus had come out with this about a year ago. Um, fits perfectly, fits like a glove to your side, lightweight, you can't beat it. It's got my vote, definitely. Remember, this gun could be yours. We're giving it away. The only thing you have to do is subscribe to our YouTube channel and make sure that you do tune in for the 2014 SHOT Show coming up next week. And as always, you can find these online at kyguncode.com.